Hi, it's Neil here from Image Restore, talking today a bit about the patch tool. The patch tool is a tool for selecting damage and or doing just that, patching out uh, cracks and creases and uh, bits of damage in an old photograph uh, simply by replacing them with tone and texture from somewhere else within the image. I was watching a lynda.com video today, uh, you can see above this tutorial video on my blog, um, about using the content aware option with the patch tool to automatically replace the texture and tone. And they were suggesting how useful it was and how quick and how much time you'd save by doing this. So I tried it out and uh, well these are the results. Let's have a look. So the patch tool selected with the content aware uh, and there's many options here in the adaptation box. You can use strict, very strict, medium, loose or, or very loose to uh, use a, the computer algorithm to fill out the dam replace the damage. So let's just try that. So here's one with very loose. And there's an old, old artifact going on there. Not perhaps the best option to choose. So let's try uh, the next one. Again, that's still there. Medium, very getting darker. Strict, darker still, and very strict. Well, see, that doesn't seem to work. The reason I'm doing this video is because I never use this content aware option with the patch tool. I like to use it as, as it is, just normal. So let's just have a go at that and see how this does. Surround that, drag. Now, I don't see, you know, that's brilliant. I don't know why I would want to use the uh, content aware if it produces all those artifacts. So um, the reason why I'm, I'm doing this video is just to say that there's more than one way to skin a cat with Photoshop. And clearly in this case, just leaving things alone is the best way to use the patch tool for this kind of damage. Well, once again, it's Neil from Image Restore. I uh, hope you enjoyed this video and hopefully you can use this to do your own restorations.